tired of D Green with this man. Hey. Josh Giddy took to Instagram. Thank you for everything. To the city for embracing me from day one. To Mr. Bennett, Sam, and Mark for giving me the opportunity to fulfill my dream of being an NBA player. I am forever grateful. My brothers, who I got to share the floor with for three years, the best group of guys I could have imagined, stuck with me through the very high highs and the very low lows. Now we all know what lows Josh Giggity is talking about, but we'll get into that later in the video. You guys know the real me. I am forever in debt to Oklahoma and no words will do justice to how much the city and the organization mean to me and my family. And of course, Josh Giddy is a very smart man for disabling his comments. The only people that can comment on Josh Giddy's post are people that he allows and people that he follows. Like most of his ex-Thunder teammates. Jalen Williams. Not the starter, but the nigga that looks like Duke Dennis. Says, gonna miss you, Joshua. And the actual starter, Jalen Williams, is crying. Go be great. Shit hologram. With the sad face. And the twist of fingers. Shay Gigius Alexander drops a few tears for Josh Giggity. Andrew Wiggins' brother, not right now, Josh. Kaysen Wallace, twisting his fingers and has a heart for Josh Giggity. Trey Sean Mann is heartbroken that Josh Giggity gets traded to the Bulls. And even the official OKC Thunder page leaves hearts for Josh Giddy. Now, all jokes aside, Josh Giddy is actually a pretty good point guard, bro. Remind you, this guy is like, what, 21, 22, if that? This guy is 6'8". So this guy is a tall-ass point guard with great vision. Like, he's a true floor general. Do y'all think this is a fair trade for Alex Caruso? Now, Alex Caruso is a true veteran at this point. One of the best defensive guards in the NBA, bro. And it is obvious that OKC wants to win now. So it makes sense why they traded away Josh Giddy. The Thunder just got way better on defense. They were already a great defensive team with Lou Dort and shit hologram. Now you add Alex Caruso. These teams are going to have a problem trying to score on OKC. And remind you, Shea Gigius is going to give you 30 every single night but good luck to josh giddy on the bulls let's take a first look at him landing in chicago oh my fucking josh god fucking, fucking josh get it is she of age is she of age giggity giggity goo if you actually watch the thunder in this year's playoffs you could already see that Josh Giddy was going to get traded, bro. He literally got benched the first time ever in his career in the playoffs, bro. He's been a starter his entire life, but as soon as they got to the playoffs, he got benched. Like I said, Josh Giddy is a great playmaker, but he's not the best defender and he is not the best three-point shooter. But Josh Giddy definitely has all-star potential. That season, he averaged 12 points, 6 rebounds, and 5 assists. That is actually pretty good stats for a 21-year-old 
starting on a number one seed playoff team. Now, I know everybody likes to make jokes about what happened to Josh Giddy. That is not what this video is about, but y'all know DeMar DeRozan just hopped on stage with Kendrick Lamar, right? Certified lover boy, certified pedophile. Wop, 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 dot, fuck him up. Wop, 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 I'ma do my stuff. They said DeMar DeRozan was just on stage calling Drake a pedophile, and now he's playing with one. I'm just fucking with you, Josh Giddy. Turns out Josh Giddy is actually innocent, ladies and gentlemen. So enough with the quagmire jokes. Giggity, giggity, dude. No more Josh Giggity slander will be tolerated, bro. This man is officially innocent, so we can no longer call Josh Giggity a PDF file. Now, Drake, on the other hand, but it looks like Josh Giggity is in good spirits. He is so, so, so excited. Now, yes, it does suck that he was just on a number one seed. And now he's getting traded to a team that only won 10 games last season. But the NBA is a business. And honestly, this is how he improves as a player, bro. Now Josh Giggity has the chance to be way more aggressive, get way more minutes, and make way more money. If Josh Giggity improves his game and the Chicago Bulls make the playoffs, he has a fat contract coming his way. So this is not really an L for Josh Giggity. And it's definitely not an L for Alex Caruso. I feel like this is a win-win, but trading Josh Diddy for Alex Caruso straight up is kind of a steal. I'm not going to lie. So the Chicago Bulls were kind of bugging for not asking for any more draft picks, bro. Remind you, Alex Caruso was a two-time all defensive player bro he just made all teams second defense this year and honestly bro i'm rooting for josh giddy now yes were we making jokes about josh giddy yes the whole entire internet was calling him josh diddy but josh giddy here's your chance bro the Chicago Bulls are giving you the keys, Josh Giddy. It looks like they're giving up on Lonzo Ball. Because Lonzo Ball literally has the same exact player build as Josh Giddy. They literally all have the same badges. So I feel like they're going to release or trade Lonzo Ball and Josh Giddy is the future. Change the narrative, Josh Giddy. I promise you if the Bulls make the playoffs next season, nobody will be calling you Josh Diddy ever again. It's a parade inside my city. No, 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 it's not, my nigga. It's definitely not a parade inside your city.